we're going to draw this toucan, right? So, um, as you can see, the background is pretty plain, but you can make it a lot fancier if you want to. I think I'm going to make mine a little bit fancier. Okay, so the first step that I'm going to do, I am going to sketch in um, where this log is, because in the picture, he's kind of, well, actually, it's a branch. It's a branch of a tree that's sticking out. So I'm going to just sketch in a line like that. And you can go in and you can add like some texture to make it look like a branch if you want to. I'm just going to kind of leave it for right now and get my main shape sketched in. So um, I want to sketch in the shape of my toucan. And I want to start with his body shape. So I'm just going to bring it down kind of like this. Okay, I'm going to make it darker. Um, I haven't drawn anything that connects to the log yet, but I will. Okay, right. so I'm going to draw a shape kind of like that. Um, my line for the log underneath, if you can't see it, looks like that. Okay. I'm going to bring this line up and curve it around because I'm going to draw in his head next. Okay. So then I'm going to bring this line kind of up in a curve, and then I'm going to draw in the beak, which is pretty massive. Two hands have a really large beak. It's almost as big as he is. Okay, I also want to sketch in where his feet are. So I know that they're going to be right in here. I'm not going to draw details yet. I'm just going to draw a little line to show you. Okay, and a little line for the tail here. I'm going to draw this dark edge right here. And we're going to draw his eye, which is round. And it's right here. So let's go ahead and draw this colorful patch around our toucan's eye. It's going to be kind of large. So it's shaped kind of like that. I'm going to darken it in so you can see it a little bit better. I'll show you the picture again. It's like that colorful spot on there, that yellow spot. Okay. And then around his eye, he's got a green patch that you can sketch in. So this part, on this particular toucan is green, but on your toucan, it could be whatever color you like. I'm going to make this edge of the beak kind of dark. He almost looks like a cartoon um, because he's got these dark lines that outline some of his features. So you can darken that in. Then I'm going to draw a stripe that goes down his beak. It's going to come all the way down. It's kind of like a skinny triangle that curves. So that, so that practically his nostrils? Well, it's actually not his nostrils. If you look carefully at the picture, it's just a colorful stripe. And also, he has the end of his, his beak is a different color. He's got kind of a blue-green here, and then this part is red. So you can kind of sketch that in. And you can also sketch in, it's got a little bit of, it's like kind of a stripey thing going on. 
And now I'm going to work on his feet because I just made him like stick feet. So now I'm going to make him have a little more dimension, a little more thickness. And so um, I'm going to add a little bit of a shadow here and a little bit of a shadow to the bottom edge right there. So it looks a little more dimensional. I'm going to draw in this foot now. To make it quite a perfectly straight line you can give it a little bit of a textured edge because those feathers make a pretty smooth looking shape but it's not perfectly smooth so anyway this section here is all going to be black i'm going to just scribble it in real fast um then also um i'm going to shade this in light gray so that it has contrast to this part. This part would be yellow, and this part would be kind of a green color. And this part, I'm gonna make kind of light. And I'm gonna make this slightly darker. And then this part's gonna be a little bit not as dark as you thought. So um, to finish it up, right now I've got a pretty interesting looking bird, but the rest of it's kind of boring. And when you look at the photograph that we're working from, it is kind of a boring background. But like I said, I want to make it a little bit more exciting because this is the jungle, right? So I'm just going to draw in some leaf shapes. This is going to be kind of a heart shaped leaf. And so I'm going to do several different kinds of leaves actually. I'm not going to do all the same kinds. This one's going to be a little bit different. And if I knew a lot about plants, I'd tell you like what kind of leaf I was trying to represent, but I don't. So, I'm going to make one come down from this way. So, just kind of sketch in some different leaf shapes. Maybe there's a vine hanging down somewhere. Just make it interesting. So fill in your, the rest of your design. If you want to, you can add a little bit of value to this branch, a little texture. And of course, if you are 
I'm proud of your drawing. You need to sign it.